But I'm still angry with what they've been allowed to do. I'm still angry that my rights and my freedoms have been taken away for six months. I'm still angry that the public are had to support a case to the tune of sixty thousand pounds. This has cost sixty thousand pounds. Yeah? How? Why? Why was I in court in the first place? Who should be in court? The officer who who attacked me? The officer who gave the full sack order? The officer who admitted changing the forms? They should be in court. Someone should face someone should face punishment for what's happened. I, but I feel um, I am happy. I am happy. I just still think that. I still think I, I know they're going to do this again. Right. Yeah? They're just going to be more careful with the paperwork. It's a, it, well, it, it's it, it, it's a weapon they use. Lawfare is a weapon. Yeah. They they use the judiciary. They use the police to silence you, to harass you. As I said, this is probably the seventh or eighth time I've been in court on this case. Just on this case, your time's taken up, your energy's taken up. You're continually fighting the system, yeah? and they throw it all that you come to from everywhere. So, I am happy. Yeah. Yeah. Hang on, look. I am happy. I'm, I'm a bit overwhelmed because I didn't expect. I just don't ex didn't expect the judge to ever side me. There was no jury in there. It was a judge. So I'm glad we found a judge who stood on truth. Because I've been in some of these court cases before where I think, well, we, we won we won that, and then I end up getting I end up getting uh, getting convicted. So yeah, I'm happy. And it's an embarrassment for the Met. A total embarrassment for them. Their behaviour is an embarrassment. Their actions are behaviour. The fact they've gone through this case is an embarrassment. Your lawyer asked for costs, you didn't get them. No, I know, that's what I mean. So they win anyway. Yeah? So £60,000 was spent. If it was unlawful, pay the money back. Yeah? Pay the money that's been spent. They've just said no. So what then? Like It's like, so they win anyway, because they drain you. Yeah, I've probably spent, spent in excess of £600,000 on legal fees. Yeah. They win. What's next? What's happening next? I think there was a delay in court today to prevent you from going to a St. Green's Day demonstration. Well, we're making it now. I'm going to go get out, I'm going to go get out of this suit. We're going to go join everyone else. I'm going to go and say hello. I need to get home to my family. I've got things going on. Yeah, I know. I've got things going on at home. But, um, yeah, what's next? June the 1st. Try and get try and get over. Ezra, if you're watching this, get over. We're going to have a massive march through London against two-tier police, and I'm going to show a documentary which is going to awaken the British public to the totalitarian state that we already live in. And a message for your supporters, not just in my home country of Canada, but around the world, who have been watching so intently your, your fight for free speech. That... I know I'm not alone everywhere I go, I feel like I've got an army, even when I'm walking on my own, even when I've been put in prison, I know there's an army behind me, so I never feel alone, so, and those people, even if I was ever to get the opportunity to feel down, I don't get one, because I walk through the street and people embrace me, hug me, and, and shake my hand, and I, I feel their emotion and their inspiration in, in continuing, so I'm grateful, and, but what you need to understand is, you see what's happened to me here, that's how, I've got a platform, people know who I am. Do you know how many people this is happening to? Yeah? There's people who haven't got a voice. And they're being imprisoned, they're being falsely accused, they're being labelled, they're being slandered, they're losing their work. You all know it, everyone knows it. Everyone knows what's happening. I'm lucky enough that I have the support for people to back me. But how many people out there don't have that support? Who, who, who this is happening to, who no one even knows. Who the state is being turned on for because they're whistleblowers or speaking out, they're challenging narratives. So yeah, but to the people who support me, I'm incredibly grateful. I value every one of you. You enable me to continue fighting. Um, yeah, and love to you all. Tommy, congratulations. No, I'm you. shocked you won. So Take am I, man. I know, so am I. I was hearing enough speeches. So I'm right. What are we going to say now? <laughs> but yeah, I'm grateful. Great. Thank you for coming. Thank you, Tommy. Thank you for coming. Thank you.